guys, a quick little update. Um, my room is still going under, you know, repairs and stuff like that. Um, I'll show you the final product when I get there. We're waiting to bring in to sand and paint my vanity to bring it in so that I have a nice place to film videos. Um, another thing that I got today, I I don't know if you saw my last video, but my I got the Naked 3 palette. And I will be planning to do a tutorial on it. This is just the box because I put away the palette. I'm currently wearing it on my eyes. Along with some of the products that I'm going to mention that I got today from the mail. And I don't know if you can guess from who I got it from, but it starts with a C and ends with a pop. Yep. If you guessed right, it's ColourPop. I mean, it's kind of obvious. You can read the name of the title of the video. But, yeah. I told you last time in my last ColourPop mini review video that I was going to be getting new items from ColourPop in the mail. And they finally arrived. Um, I ordered one lippy stick, a lippy pencil... Uh, a gel cream eyeliner and the cream gel eyeliner pencil to match it and the color I ordered was Aquarius which I know 100% for a fact that um, Kathleen Lights collaborated with Colourpop and they made this and this is the color here and I got this mainly because I'm an Aquarius and yeah and if you guys don't know, my birthday was yesterday. I posted this. I posted. I posted. I'm going to be posting this video today. If you guys. Yeah. If I don't post this video today, don't worry about it. My birthday was the 29th. So, yeah. Of January. But, yeah. I ordered that lipstick because of my birthday. Because I'm an Aquarius. And because I love the color. And I also ordered the matching lippy stick pencil the lippy pencil in Aquarius as well and what I can tell off the bat from this pencil is it's a little bit it's a little bit darker than the lipstick but yeah but I think that I make a good contrast so yeah um now talking about the packaging again I love the packaging of Colourpop they're just so nice they're so sleek and it has the color at the bottom so I won't confuse them with my other Colourpop products now so the fun part is you guys will never guess what color I got from the from the Colourpop website in eyeliner um, I'll give you a big hint I'm currently wearing it and if you guys guess back you're totally wrong well I got the gel cream eyeliner in Boots. And this is what Boots looks like. Let me get a little pencil or something to be able to swatch this on my hand. What I'm using right now is not an eyeliner pencil to put this on my hand. Is that the eyeliner pencil that I have, eyeliner like brush that I have, I used it with my L'Oreal black one. With my L'Oreal infallible black gel eyeliner. So I don't want to mix the color and have it damage the pink. You get what I'm saying? So yeah, this, I used a lip brush from Studio Beauty for that. So this is the color when you apply it and this right here is the matching eyeliner that I got the matching boots eyeliner that I got so I can put it in my waterline I'm currently wearing it right now I'm also wearing the pink on top of the black because I just wanted to try it out before I filmed this video and I gotta say that I love it while I do prefer the consistency consistency eh, consistency of my L'Oreal infallible black eyeliner better but I, I still really do like this eyeliner. The other one, my L'Oreal Infallible Black Eyeliner is just a little bit more creamy. This one's kind of a little bit harder. So, like, it's kind of, like, stiff. It feels kind of like clay. But, yeah. That's the only that's the only complaint I have with this. They feel kind of like clay and it's not as soft as any other gel eyeliner. I mean, like, the only gel eyeliner that I really experience in a pot is my L'Oreal Infallible Black one because I bought it to try it because I've never had I've never used gel eyeliner in a pot so yeah 
And so, if now, when I got, the only thing that was disappointing about this shipping was, when I got this, this, the eyeliner and boots broke. Like, when I went like this, this came, this part flew out twice, and I had to put a ship back in. But, like, right now, I guess I pushed it in, right? Because now it's, it goes in and now, like, normal. And this piece right here was a little coming off a little, was, like, off a little so I had to push it in but I guess that was with the way they they sent it because none of my other color pop products have any problems it's just this eyeliner I don't know if when they shipped it like I guess like there was a damage it got damaged on the way here with the postman I don't know but I really do enjoy these products and I will be doing a wear test to compare my L'Oreal infallible to my ColourPop one not color wise but lasting power wise and so yeah I'll be doing I'm gonna be looking weird for that video I'm gonna be doing just the pink on one eye and just the black on the other eye and seeing a wear test wise because I do not own the black one from ColourPop because I didn't I didn't see why I'd have to buy a black one if I already have a black one from L'Oreal it doesn't make any sense that's just a waste of six dollars So, yeah. Another thing that I got today that has nothing to do with ColourPop. I am so sorry. I'm so random. I'm just going to bring this in the video. Is I got this really pretty jumbo lip pencil from Avon. Like, yeah. It's like a nude. Oh, my God. It's so close to the color. It's, it's similar to Aquarius. I guess that's why I put it in this video. It's so similar to Aquarius. So, like... If you guys, I don't know, if you guys don't like the consistency of the ColourPop one, you can just buy this Avon one in Ferris Nude if you don't like ColourPop. So that's the only little random bit tidbit that's going to be in this video. Um, So yeah, I will be doing a tutorial with my Naked 3 palette. I'm currently wearing it. I decided to test it out instead of filming the tutorial. I wanted to test it out to see how it wore. So yeah. I will be doing a tutorial with this look. And I also used in my look today the NYX Strawberry Milk Pencil. Jumbo Eyeliner Pencil. I think it's, no, it's the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Strawberry Milk. My bad. I'm thinking of melting it down and putting it in a pot like this. Like, obviously not this pot because it's the eyeliner. But I'm thinking of doing that because I saw a lot of videos on YouTube today. About that how they do that and they use it as a cream eyeshadow instead of a pencil. And that it lasts longer like that. So I'm thinking about really doing that. Because I also have this the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. And I'm planning on doing that. And then I have a collection. And then collect all of them. And like have a collection of cream eyeshadows in a pot. And it'll be like really, really cool. But yeah, that's all for this video, guys. I hope you like it. And subscribe, like, and share. And I will be getting more stuff from ColourPop. Because I don't know. I just, I've fallen in love with ColourPop. So... Tell me what you think. I hope you like it. And, oh, I'm currently wearing the Aquarius lipstick right now. I don't know if I forgot to tell you. I'm not wearing it with the lip liner, though. But I'm currently wearing it. And I love it. And more about the topic of my birthday. I just turned 19. So, yeah. If you guys are wondering how old I am. Because I know I kind of look like, without makeup, I kind of look like a 15-year-old girl. Yeah. I get that a lot. Sometimes I even get called like a 12 year old. So, you know what I mean? Well, bye guys. I hope you have a nice day and, I mean, or night because what's left of the day. But I guys, I hope you guys have a nice day, a nice week, and I hope you like and subscribe and share this video. See you guys later. I'll be doing another video soon. Bye.